Hello, my friends, to a new video, this time in English, will be good for uh, practice. Oh. Get down. Get down. And yeah, this video is about uh, how I change my Yanchi Zolder from gravel bike to a cyclocross bike. Because this Saturday I have my first cyclocross race, so and I will I will show you what I, I change in my bike to make it a fast cyclocross bike. Let's do it. Okay, first of all, I will start for the things they cost zero. So the first thing is take the tool back because we know we'll need it. If something happens in a cyclocross race, you have the car or the van uh, not far, so you just go to the van. And that's it. Cool. The next one will be take off the porta bidon. Uh, I just will take off one because it's still really, really warm here, and uh, maybe I will need water. And also for training, uh, it's good to uh, keep one. Uh, you can uh, take a bottle. Uh, and we will take this one because uh, still with one. Uh, we want Porta Bidon, we can train, tra take the bike, and we can climb steps and everything. So let's take this off. Okay, so like you can see, we take it off, but you still can carry the bike. Uh, and yeah, just needs to be a little careful. But yeah, next step wheels. Next one, and the biggest change will be wheels or tires uh, I will change uh, wheels because these these wheels are tubeless uh, and these wheels are tubular if you know don't have another uh, pair of uh, wheels you can just uh, change the tire you just take off the gravel tire and put a 33 millimeters tubular cyclocross tire uh, me I will change the wheels and will be one step closer okay my friends like you can see anyway the chicken is stuck uh, you can see this is looking really good looks like already a cycle goes by but still a few things to do uh, one really important put a chain guide uh, because I don't have it in uh, when I'm riding gravel because I don't ride a really, really bumpy tracks. It's just I'm using it for training. But in cyclocross uh, and the field races are really the circuits are hard pack, uh, quite bumpy. So it's really important to put a chain guide. If not, uh, yeah, the the chain can come off, and you will lo lose quite a lot of time. Really cheap, and uh, I will save you to get out of the bike so let's put it in cool so that's it i think bike uh, is pretty much ready i finally take the second uh, uh, bottle holder because it uh, looks more clean and uh, i can put the bottle in my bag and yeah uh, and personally for me just i will need to do two things before race is uh, put a little bit down the seat post like two millimeters just because uh, yeah maybe it's mentally but I feel more secure and uh, yeah just uh, I feel more secure and uh, the Garmin Garmin uh, support as well we will take it out when we go racing and uh, we'll have the watch but yeah just uh, one more thing to do is try the bike 